Chapter 1. The Excitement of Street Markets The street markets in the town were always filled with excitement. People from all walks of life would gather there, eager to experience the hustle and bustle of the lively atmosphere. As you entered the market, you could feel the energy buzzing all around you. The market was a colorful sight to behold. Stalls were lined up one after another, displaying a variety of goods. Fruit and vegetables were neatly arranged, their vibrant colors catching the eye of each passerby. The scent of fresh produce filled the air, enticing everyone to take a closer look. There were stalls selling clothes, each with their own unique style. Brightly patterned fabrics in every shade imaginable were draped across hangers. If you were lucky, you might even find a special garment that was handmade by a local artisan. Walking further down the market, you would stumble upon a section dedicated to handmade crafts. Skilled artisans showcased their workmanship, crafting beautiful pottery, delicate jewelry, and intricate wooden carvings. The attention to detail in each piece was awe-inspiring. The market-goers were always in a cheerful mood, haggling with the vendors to get the best deals. Laughter and friendly banter echoed through the narrow aisles, creating a joyful cacophony. Sometimes, street performers would add to the lively atmosphere, entertaining the crowd with their juggling acts or musical talents. Children, too, were captivated by the allure of the street markets. They would eagerly drag their parents from one stall to another, pointing excitedly at things they wanted to buy. Balloons in all shapes and sizes floated above their heads, adding an extra touch of whimsy, to the scene. Food stalls lined the edges of the market, offering delicious treats from all around the world. The aroma of sizzling street food wafted through the air, making everyone's mouth water. You could find anything from spicy tacos and fragrant curries to crispy fried chicken and sweet pastries. The variety of flavors was enough to satisfy any craving. As the day turned into evening, the market seemed to come alive even more. Soft twinkling lights were hung above each stall, casting a warm glow over the bustling crowd. The sound of music filled the air, inviting everyone to dance along and let loose. As the sun set and the crowd slowly dispersed, the street markets would begin to wind down. But the excitement and memories created there would remain with the visitors, leaving them eagerly awaiting their next visit. So, if you ever find yourself craving an adventure filled with vibrant colors, delicious food, and a lively atmosphere, don't forget to visit the street markets in our town. You won't be disappointed. Question, what makes street markets so exciting? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 2. Unveiling the Cultural Delights at Street Markets In Chapter 2, we will discover the incredible cultural delights at street markets. Street markets are bustling places where people come together to buy and sell all sorts of things. But what makes these markets extra special are the traditional crafts, ethnic food, and folk performances. When you visit a street market, you will find a whole world of traditional crafts. Craftsmen and women set up their stalls to display their beautiful creations. There are colorful handmade clothes, unique pieces of jewelry, and intricate pottery. You can even find hand-woven baskets and wooden carvings. It's amazing to see the skill and creativity that goes into making these traditional crafts. And let's not forget about the delicious ethnic food at street markets. As you explore the different stalls, your nose will be filled with mouth-watering aromas. There are stalls selling spicy curries, fragrant stir-fries, and crispy snacks. You can also find stalls offering traditional sweets and refreshing drinks. Be sure to try something new and exciting. The flavors will transport you to distant lands. But the cultural delights don't stop there. Street markets are also a hub for folk performances. Musicians, dancers, and storytellers gather to entertain the crowds. 
You might see a group of dancers swirling around in vibrant costumes or a musician playing a traditional instrument with great skill. These performances bring the spirit of different cultures to life, enchanting both young and old. One sunny day, Sarah and her family decided to visit a famous street market in their city. As they weaved their way through the crowd, they couldn't help but be amazed by all the fantastic things they saw. They stopped at a stall selling handmade dolls dressed in traditional outfits. Sarah couldn't resist buying one as a souvenir to remember the day. Next, they explored the food section of the market. The smell of sizzling spices filled the air, making their tummies grumble in anticipation. They decided to try a plate of steaming dumplings from a stall run by a friendly lady named May. The dumplings were so tasty that they went back for seconds. After filling their bellies, they wandered over to a small stage where a group of musicians was setting up. The musicians started playing their instruments, producing beautiful melodies that floated through the air. Sarah couldn't help but tap her feet to the rhythm, completely captivated by the performance. Feeling inspired, Sarah's dad surprised her by buying a traditional drum from a nearby stall. Sarah's eyes lit up with joy, and she couldn't wait to learn how to play it back at home. It would be a wonderful reminder of their special day at the street market. As the day came to an end, Sarah and her family left the street market with big smiles on their faces. They were grateful for the cultural delights they had discovered the traditional crafts, the mouth-watering food, and the captivating folk performances. They couldn't wait to explore more street markets in the future, unraveling the rich tapestry of cultures that exist in their city. Question, what kind of cultural delights can be found at street markets? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 3, Bargain Hunting at Street Markets Chapter 3 Bargain hunting at street markets Emma and her family loved exploring the vibrant street markets in their city. The bustling atmosphere and the wide array of goods always excited them. They were on a mission today to find the best bargains. As soon as they arrived, Emma's eyes lit up with joy. Colorful tents lined the streets, displaying all kinds of items, clothes, accessories, toys, and even fresh fruits and vegetables. The air was filled with the aroma of various types of street food, making their stomachs rumble with hunger. Emma and her family began their bargain hunting adventure by browsing through the stalls. The sellers were busy showcasing their products and enthusiastically inviting customers to their booths. Some sellers even offered samples to entice people to buy their goods. Emma's father was skilled in the art of haggling. He had a way with sellers, always managing to get the best deals. Emma observed as he approached the first stall, a stall selling beautiful handmade jewelry. He exchanged pleasantries with the seller, complimenting the craftsmanship of the pieces. After browsing through the collection, Emma's father selected a necklace he liked. The seller quoted a price, but her father knew he could get a better deal. He confidently started negotiating, proposing a lower price. The seller smiled and countered with a slightly higher offer. The haggling continued until they finally agreed on a price that satisfied both parties. Seeing her father's success, Emma decided to try her hand at haggling too. She spotted a toy stall that had adorable stuffed animals. Emma was captivated by a soft, fluffy teddy bear and couldn't resist the urge to ask the seller about its cost. The seller replied, it's twenty dollars, but for you I can make it fifteen. Emma hesitated, wanting an even better deal. She responded, hum, how about twelve dollars? I really, really like this teddy bear. The seller smiled kindly and said, okay, deal. Twelve dollars it is. Enjoy your new friend. Emma beamed with joy, proud of her successful bargaining skills. She quickly joined her family, who were busy picking out fresh fruits and vegetables. They found a seller who had an amazing variety of affordable produce. 
Emma's mother skillfully inspected each item, ensuring they were fresh and ripe. With a warm smile, the seller informed her, For you, I will give you a discount. Two for the price of one. Emma's family happily filled their bags with all the delicious fruits and vegetables they needed. They were thrilled with the savings they had made throughout their bargain hunting adventure. As they walked back home, Emma couldn't help but feel proud of her family's ability to find affordable prices. She realized that street markets were not only exciting places to explore, but also treasure troves for finding great bargains. With their bags full and spirits high, Emma and her family looked forward to their next adventure at the street markets, ready to discover more hidden gems and test their haggling skills once again. Question, how can one enjoy bargain hunting at street markets? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 4, The Flavors of Street Market Cuisine In the vibrant city of meandering, there were street markets filled with enticing smells and colorful stalls. Here, you could find the most delicious and mouth-watering flavors of cuisine from all over the world. The local street food vendors were always busy, serving up traditional snacks and dishes that would make your taste buds dance with joy. And let's not forget the desserts, oh, those heavenly mouth-watering desserts. As the sun rose, the street markets came alive with the hustle and bustle of people. Families and friends gathered to explore the food-filled wonderland. You could hear the sizzling sound of grilled meat, the rhythmic chopping of vegetables, and the playful banter of the vendors. One of the most popular stalls belonged to Mrs. Lee, a sweet old lady known for her delectable dumplings. With a smile that sparkled like the sun, she would serve her customers with warm and freshly steamed dumplings. Each bite was a burst of flavors, filled with juicy meats and vegetables. People would line up eagerly, waiting for their turn to savor her tasty treats. Next to Mrs. Lee's stall was Mr. Patel's Spicy Corner. He would skillfully blend a variety of Indian spices to create the most flavorful and aromatic curry dishes. The air around his stall was filled with the fragrant scent of cumin, coriander, and turmeric. Visitors would marvel at his skill as he added secret ingredients to his pots, transforming ordinary vegetables or meats into a spicy paradise. Walking further along the street, you would stumble upon a rainbow of tropical fruits at Mrs. Chang's colorful stall. Bright oranges, juicy watermelons, and succulent mangoes filled her baskets. She would expertly slice them into bite-sized pieces, allowing visitors to enjoy the natural sweetness of each fruit. The refreshing flavors would quench your thirst and leave you feeling revitalized. But the highlight of the street markets was undoubtedly the dessert corner. There, Mr. Garcia, the master of sweets, ruled with his mouth-watering creations. With his nimble fingers, he would shake doughnuts, sprinkle them with powdered sugar, and serve them warm to his customers. Each bite was like a sugary dream, melting in your mouth and leaving you yearning for more. The street markets of meandering were not just about the flavors of cuisine, they were a celebration of culture and diversity. People from all walks of life would gather here, eager to experience the unique tastes, sights, and sounds. It was a place where strangers became friends over a shared love for good food. As the sun set, the street markets gradually quieted down. The vendors would pack up their stalls, ready to return the next day with new surprises. The day had been filled with laughter, delicious treats, and memories that would last a lifetime. So, if you ever find yourself in meandering, be sure to visit the street markets and indulge in the flavors of street market cuisine. Immerse yourself in the lively atmosphere, try the local street foods, snack on traditional treats, and top it all off with some mouth-watering desserts. You won't be disappointed. Your taste buds will thank you for the culinary adventure. Question, what kind of delicious cuisine can be found at street markets? Check the video description for the answer. Chapter 5, Exploring Unique Handicrafts at Street Markets 
In this chapter, we will be exploring unique handicrafts at street markets. These markets are bustling with all kinds of beautiful and handmade items that you won't find anywhere else. From delicate handmade jewelry to vibrant and colorful textiles, there is something for everyone to discover. When you visit these markets, you will be amazed by the wide variety of handicrafts available. You might come across a stall selling intricately designed pottery. The pots are carefully crafted with skilled hands, and each one is a work of art. They come in different shapes, sizes, and colors, making it difficult to choose just one. As you walk further, you will spot vendors selling an array of handmade jewelry. The jewelry is made with love and care, using different materials such as beads, shells, and stones. The colors are so vibrant that they catch your eye from a distance. From necklaces to bracelets, you can find unique pieces that will add a special touch to your outfits. One of the highlights of these street markets is the colorful textiles. The stalls are filled with fabrics in every shade imaginable. You can find beautiful fabrics with intricate designs, ranging from traditional patterns to more modern ones. These textiles are often used to make clothing, accessories, and even home decorations. Imagine having a cushion or a rug made from these beautiful fabrics in your home. As you continue to explore, you may notice the talented artisans working on their crafts right before your eyes. It's fascinating to see their hands skillfully creating these unique pieces. You can watch as they weave colorful threads into intricate patterns or shape clay into beautiful pottery. Their dedication and passion for their crafts are truly inspiring. The atmosphere at these street markets is lively and energetic. People from all walks of life come together to appreciate and support these talented artisans. It's a place where you can not only buy beautiful handicrafts, but also learn about different cultures and traditions. Visiting these street markets is an experience like no other. It's a chance to immerse yourself in the beauty and creativity of handmade crafts. Whether you are looking for a special gift or want to add some unique pieces to your collection, these markets have something for everyone. In conclusion, street markets are a treasure trove of unique handicrafts. From handmade jewelry to colorful textiles and intricate pottery, there is so much to discover. These markets offer a glimpse into the talent and creativity of artisans from around the world. So, the next time you have the opportunity, make sure to explore these street markets and find something truly extraordinary. Question, what unique handicrafts can be explored at street markets? Check the video description.